Hi guys, just another video. So uh, my thoughts on the Avengers Age of Ultron and the Comic Con, they did came all of them. Um, everybody came, including Robert Downey Jr. <laughs> um, but it's got, um, it's kind of John Hansen. Uh, she didn't came because uh, she's pregnant. She got busy, if you know what I mean. Uh, so everybody came, Chris Hainsworth, Mark Ruffalo, Paul Brittany, uh, the guy from kick and to Aaron, oh, fuck, I've got forgotten his name, Elizabeth, something, you know, she's the Mary Kate sister, that's one of her sister, the, their sisters, uh, whom Jeremy Renner and Chris Evans and uh, Samuel Jackson and I think Josh Reading was there and Jane Spade as Ultron. So they were all there just promoting the movie to come out next year. May the 24th in Europe and May the 1st in the States. So I was watching a few stuff and panels and stuff and uh, I noticed there was the footage out there and uh, Obviously, my friend saw the footage and he showed it to me. So, I'm not going to say anything, but I will say this. Um, everybody's saying, well, what I'm saying, that um, someone picked up false hammer. It'll probably be Hulk or Cap. So, that's, that's what I'm saying. So, I saw some few interviews on IGN and stuff, you know, you know all the actors, what they're saying, such and forth. And also, they have to stay quiet because of Marvel and Disney. So, uh, I know the gist what's going on. So, I'm not going to say. So, uh, it is what it is. Um, but so far, so good, you know. Um, you know, they're still filming. They got out uh, scheduled just to come to San Diego Comic Con for this year. Just to do, you know. And, uh, yeah. And they're just talking about the movie. How it's, have to have the m pop. The first one, such and forth, and uh, I don't know if it's gonna be good or not because also my my favorite superhero team, and and you can do individually superhero solo team these guys as well. Um, yeah, you know Marvel and Disney with the Marvel Cinematic Universe movie franchise. Um, yeah, it's gonna be good. Uh, you know the movie's coming next year. You know, they one step forward, then Warner Bros. <laughs> and DC Comics, you know, when I saw the Batman vs. Superman, Dawn of Justice, panel and stuff, and you know, you know, uh, I don't know, we'll see, we'll see what the upcoming future, I heard they're gonna keep making more movies since 2025, or, that's if they keep making Marvel movies and, uh, and everybody t lives up to, to that those next couple of years, I don't know, so, I don't know, I'll be, I'll probably be old and I'll still watch it to the day I die watching my old movies, and, uh, obviously Disney, you know, um, yeah, it's just see how it is, isn't it, so, I don't know, it's just gonna be weird, you know, if they're gonna keep making these movies and making reboots, well, I don't know, they, they should keep making reboots, you know, and I heard just reading, it's not gonna do Avengers three. I heard they they're gonna do it. You know, right after uh, Avengers two was announced last year, after Avengers one came out in 2012. It's been two years since the first one came out. Um, also, we got the solo movies like Iron Man one to three, and Cap one to two, and four one to two. And I heard they're gonna make Black Widow movie. I'm definitely not gonna watch that. And uh, Scarlett Johansson, she's an okay actress, but I don't see her as a great actress as Black Widow. That's my opinion. You know, I've seen other movies, and other movies are like, ugh. And Mark Ruffalo as Hulk and Bruce Banner. When I first saw the movie with Avengers with him, he did an okay job, but when he's playing as Hulk and the CGI, it's okay. I still like Edward Norton as Hulk. Because he did a really good job in the 2008 movie. Um, I heard he's going to do a solo movie with Hulk. So, you know, rebooting the franchise. You know, it's kind of worrying. You know, if they're going to do a good job. I don't know. Mark Ruffley, he's an okay actor. I've seen his other movies, you know. You know, he's kind of stale, so. And other actors, Aaron and 
uh, the Mary Kate Ashley sister Elizabeth something. I haven't really known them, and the other movies kind of bore me. So that's the problem. And uh, yeah, and Chris Hamer's in with other movies kind of bore me, and the other two four movies kind of suck for me. Um, Four is not my favorite character, unfortunately, but he he's kind of interesting if you you know he's in Avengers this and that. But you know he's a god of thunder, and I heard um, they want to make four as a female character now. I don't know what they're doing, what the fuck they're doing. So Marvel and Disney, you know, they keep changing up to the pace. And the other character, you know, the other actor, Paul Bentley has Vision. A.K. He's going to be Jarvis as well. He's playing him as the voice of him. Obviously, he's not going to do that good physical work. Obviously, he's going to be CJ like Hulk and Ultron. And Ultron as James Spader. You know, I hope he does a good job. You know, but he's just doing the voice of him. I don't, I don't know how he's going to sound like, but uh, we'll see. You know, I did saw the trailer. Well, it's not a trailer. It's just a footage, so I'm not going to say what's happening. Um, you know, because if I, you know, I'm not going to say, I'm going to get in. So, uh, yeah, it's just how it is, guys, you know, we'll just see what happens when the movie comes officially, when the Marvel and Disney release the trailer online, so, uh, so everybody can see. And just see if it's better than the first one, you know, um, I do have high hopes for this one, including the, um, Superman, no, Batman vs Superman. Donald Justice. I don't want to be negative to my favorite superheroes, especially my favorite franchise, Marvel and DC Comics. And uh, we'll see what happens, you know. And I'm looking forward for Guardians of the Galaxy. Um, obviously, people are being a bit negative towards the film. Um, obviously, I just want to see Rocket Raccoon. Um, but we'll see, we'll see, you know, um, if the movie's going to live up to the expectation. If they're copying similar to the comic, that's fine. Obviously, it's Hollywood. They're going to keep changing it. You know? And obviously, they make millions and billions of pounds, how much they make. So, it, it doesn't really matter if they really care about the fans or themselves. That, that's the acting, the producers, and the sector being and the president. You get the point. And the guy who owns like, the Marvel and Disney World, this, um, you get the point. So, they're making the money. So, as long as people are watching it, they make the money. So... Yeah, it is what it is. So, uh, yeah, that's about it, guys. I'm just making the point, and uh, thanks for watching. And uh, I think I'll make a one more video for San Diego Comic Con and wrap up for 2014. Um, so, yeah, more to come. Thanks for watching. Peace and more to come.